and welcome to CoinGeek Backstage. I'm Sarah Higgs and I'm here with Dr. Alia Sadawi. Alia, how are you today? Uh, thank you, it's good to see everybody here. And how have you been enjoying the conference? Oh, pretty well. It's very good to see Dr. Wright on person. I was uh, following his work and to know that he's in Dubai, it was a great opportunity and to be in campus in Dubai University, it's, it's a great gathering. So I heard you ask Dr. Craig Wright a question about proof of stake. Would you mind telling us what the question was? Well, actually, proof of work is the consensus algorithm for the Bitcoin. And in my opinion, this is the consensus algorithm because this is what proves that we have a really decentralized network that is fair and trusted. But most of the new blockchains and unfortunately some of those who already have proof of work are changing to proof of stake. I wanted to see his insight about that because in my opinion that uh, jeopardized the idea of having a decentralized and fair network and fortunately he really agrees with me because when you are moving to proof of stake you are making rich people richer and because you are enabling more people who can buy stake who can put stake to control the network so we are actually having the name of blockchain but in essence we are going back to centralized networks. So I had his insight and it was really good to hear his voice about it. Yeah, Craig is not a fan of proof of stake either. So. He, he presented a model that's the perfect model, the fair, the decentralized, the one that actually is the Satoshi vision. This is why blockchain started. And when we look at the market, we see a lot of deviation and I call it noise. But as he says, the market will, will, will one day will be you know, regulated and these noise will go. So let, let's hope it, it happens quickly. So what are your thoughts on Bitcoin Satoshi Vision? I'm really interested to use it. I'm a blockchain developer and I work some on other blockchains regarding smart contracts. And this is what I'm my, uh, my PhD is about, like blockchain implementations for enterprises. And I'm really eager to go through the documentation and see what are the tools provided by BSV for implementations other than the financial part, where we can use it in healthcare and sustainability and supply chain logistics. So I am exploring that and it could be my blockchain for the next project. So let's see to it. That's exciting. The UAE, there's a lot of talk about governments using blockchain, but it's not actually happening in many places. But in the UAE, it is really happening. Is that something you're proud of? Of course, so UAE is pioneering in everything. And this is not a surprise. Uh, having Dr. Wright here is a proof that like, he's here in Dubai, not somewhere else. But we all know that blockchain is new and we can understand if things are going slowly but uh, we are hopeful because we believe in the technology. We are believers, you know? <laughs> so I think it will happen soon for Dubai, for other places. And it's totally logical to have it in Dubai first. All right, thank you so much for your time, Dr. Alia, and thank you for watching. Data is double-edged. Wield it well and build your place in tomorrow. But trust it blindly and risk watching your progress crumble. Because much of the data we rely upon isn't reliable at all. At Enchain, we believe in data, but we put no faith in it. Instead, we build tools that enable enterprises to trust the data upon which they rely. Enchain, data without question. Bitcoin mining, Bitcoin wallet, blockchain, stable coins, metanet, the evolution of money, Everybody is talking about Bitcoin today, but what exactly is it? Learn the basics from experts. Learn what Bitcoin is, how it works, and why it matters. Bitcoin 101, your ultimate guide to the fundamentals of blockchain.